Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. I'm Brett. We're continuing Aftershock Week with a review of the collection of Dark Arc. This is Arc 1 of the series that uh, pretty much is the entire volume of... Not pretty much. It is the entire uh, first volume of the series. Uh, for those who have not read this series, it is amazing. I think this is one of my favorite series to come out of Aftershock. The, we know the biblical tale of, of Noah built the ark uh, to survive the flood, put all these creatures on it, and uh, was kind of tasked with repopulating the earth. Um, what we don't know is that there was another ship at the same time. There is this guy named Shrey, who was a dark sorcerer who was tasked with saving all the monsters and mythical creatures of that time. Uh, what's his mission? What's he doing? Why is this going on? Who tasked him? All that stuff is uh, is part of the story. And it's fantastic as we follow Shrey and his family and all these mythical creatures as they kind of like parallel and shadow Noah's journey. Uh, into the unknown and what's going to come. This is good. This is so, so, so good. Uh, so this series is by Colin Bunn, who's the uh, creator of it. Juan Doe is the artist. It was introduction, I think, of Juan Doe to me. And Juan's art is amazing. Uh, Ryan Hill's the letterer. Dave Sharp uh, is another letterer. Uh, and this collects all 15 issues, the first 15 issues of the series. Um, so the st series is kind of like broken up into two main arcs. There is <clears throat> kind of a murder mystery in part of it, and then the other is very, like, Clash of the Titans take on giant monster uh, vibe to it. Uh, that shift happens around issue 9 or so. It's good. Like, it's it's original storytelling. The storytelling is really good. The writing is really good. Uh, the whole plot is intriguing. The characters are interesting. Um, Bun does a great job of mixing uh, the lead up to it, plus kind of like the present to follow their journey. We, the, the what's going on and is, is teased out in a fantastic place. Uh, we kind of learn as Shrey learns in many ways as to what's going on. Um, so it really does kind of get that feel of what's, what's God's plan and what's, what are we supposed to be doing? We as readers kind of get that vibe, uh, as well of it. Um, it's, it's, it's really, really, really interesting, um, especially when you go kind of like really dive in and to think about what's on this boat, who's in charge, and what they're kind of paralleling. You get in all sorts of really interesting philosophical questions, you know, the basic of which is like, you know, can you have good without evil sort of thing. Um, it's just a, I think, a very, not complex, but just a very well done, uh, interesting take and spin on... Uh, kind of cl the classic biblical tale uh, with a bit more depth to it um, beyond the like the philosophical debates that you might have. It's it's kind of fascinating. Um, as I said, the art is amazing. You check this out. Wando, I think, is an amazing artist. I if you've not read uh, some of his other stuff, he's doing his own creator own series. Um, that follows a, a murder mystery that's absolutely fantastic and one I think my favorite comics coming out right now. Uh, there's a second arc of Dark Arc that is going on that is well worth checking up uh, and I'm not going to ruin what that is because I don't want to let you know but we're going to show off just a little bit more of the art because it's some awesome stuff. This is just such a good series. Uh, the extras in this are covers and then there is, all right, this is a big book. There are process pages as well. Um, as I said, this is like a big, thick, real thick printed book. Uh, beautiful shirt for shelves, beautiful for coffee tables, and just well worth the read. Great story, amazing art. Um, if you, like, I'm not a religious person at all, and I was sucked into uh, this storytelling and story as a whole. Uh, go get it. It's top notch. It's not new for the week, but it's new to you. Go take advantage. Go hit up your comic shop. There's a link beneath this video. Put in your zip code to tell if it shops near you. No shop, no problem. We have affiliate links. There are affiliate links, but really you should go support your comic shop. And speaking of support, I want to thank Aftershock for us up with this review copy. You appreciate it. And thank you for watching. Now, if you're into comics, uh, if you're into Aftershock, check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. So until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky.
Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.